Welcome back to Living on an Island. And in this video, this is a beauty. In this video, I've done something a little bit different. Uh, what I've done is I've decided to shoot this video towards the evening. Most of my videos are always shot in the daytime. So welcome along to the virtual walk along here in the beautiful bay of Port Swath here in Guernsey in the Channel Islands. Now this video is very relaxing. The sea was just lapping against the shore. It's about 7.30 in the evening and um, we got about maybe an hour before high tide and it was so relaxing. This walk did me the world of good and I hope uh, for everyone out there watching this, this will give you a bit of relaxation calm the anxiety if you've got any and just listen to those waves so for anyone that's missing the sea or missing Guernsey this is going to be a really nice video for you to watch now as we walk along the sand was absolutely gorgeous the sound of the sea lapping up onto the shore was just so calming and relaxing now I'm just gonna head up here and as I walk up this beach is really nice because it's, it's cocooned by sandy dunes it's very safe and it's very accessible uh, because there's a car park at the top and there's actually a kiosk uh, there which sells all sorts of bits and pieces have toilet facilities and it really is worth having a look at that kiosk and if you're interested in seeing in detail what that kiosk looks like and what it sells and just seeing generally what the layouts like I'll leave a link on top of the screen now I had a lovely crab sandwich there and the video would just give you more, more of an idea of what the layout's like on that kiosk. So if you're interested, you can come back and have that look at that link later on. Now here, my feet were getting buried down into the sand. It's one of those times of the day where the sand was really soft. And at one point, I was getting a little bit worried because my feet were going down very deep into the sand. It turned out okay, I managed to get out of it. Now can you spot the swimmer in the sea? Took me a bit by surprise <laughs> to see someone swimming this late on in the evening. But why not? It's a beautiful day, the tide's high. What isn't there to love about this beach? So if you, for those of you who don't know, this is the west coast. And I walk the whole length of the beach. Someone's buried their feet before me in the sand, look. I walk right to the end. When I get to the end, I'll show you a lovely shot of the whole bay. What it looks like. I hope you're getting an idea of how relaxing and calming the sea is here. And there's someone else swimming as well. As we look up to the top of the beach, there's actually a pedestrian path and you can walk along the whole top. Um, I'm talking about above the beach, this little path you can walk along. So if you don't fancy getting your feet full of sand, you can always walk along the top path there and you get lovely views of the bay. Now I spotted something in the rocks here then I noticed that it was actually um, must have been the swimmers bathing trunks and his clothes to get changed back into. And there's also a push bike there for good measure. I was actually struck by how beautiful white the sun was here. The sand is particularly nice here and I think this bay is best viewed at high tide. 
if you've ever been to this bay at low tide or you haven't um, I'll, I'll tell you that it's quite stony at low tide but still a beautiful bay nevertheless and there's a few stones here but still lovely a few swimmers I mean it, w it was an exceptionally nice evening the temperature is very humid at the moment it's probably about 18 degrees at the moment although we've had some rain it's been a bit cloudy this is to be honest maybe one of the best bits of the day and I'm going to carry on walking to the end and there's a car park now this car park is obviously fine to park in it will take you obviously to the other end of the beach however um, my recommendation is that if you can park in the car park that I came from because you have the kiosk there with the toilet facilities so if you need the toilet if you sit around this end uh, you've got to walk pretty much the whole length of the beach but if you sit closer to the other side then not too much of a walk also if you want a drink or you want something to eat from the kiosk it's not too much far of a walk so that's my top tip <laughs> if that's any use to you and that's only from experience The golds certainly love this bay. Very relaxing. Very peaceful. No one round. I think the beach may have been busier earlier on. As I mentioned, it's around half past seven. And the tide, I think, had maybe an hour or so before high tide so it was nearly high tide not quite although we're starting to lose a little bit of light in this video but just enough to give us good images and to show everyone how beautiful and stunning and relaxing this bay is at this time of day thoroughly recommend doing an evening walk if you can and what I'm going to do is I'm going to head up to that second car park I mentioned just to show you it and funny enough if you carry on walking around this coast from here in about five minutes time you'd arrive at Grand Rock Bay which is another beautiful beach just around the corner and if you carried on walking from Grand Rock Bay you'd end up at Kobo Bay which is um, another really nice beach and I'll leave the link on top of the screen now for that one I did a really nice video on that a while ago Kobo Bay is very popular I wouldn't say this beach is quite as popular but they're close I think because Kobo Bay has got the rock mount above it, it draws people in a bit more so just heading on up the rocks up to the car park here we go look so this is the car park I mentioned so I've walked the whole length of the beach here and I just want to show you the whole bay that I've just walked across give you a nice view nice big shot of where we've just been just got to step over here and there we go Portsmouth Bay 7.30 in the evening how nice was that hope everyone enjoyed the video as usual click the screen to watch next video and don't forget to subscribe I'll see you next time